I'm Charlotte Wood, makeup artist for Longcomb. I've worked with Longcomb at loads of events such as the BAFTA Film Awards. I've done brand campaigns with them including Ultrawear and today we are here with the National Wedding Show showing you how to look and feel even more beautiful on your special day. I'm going to show you how to achieve a natural bridal beauty look. There's three other looks in this series though so make sure you check back to find the one that's perfect for you. To prep the skin I've cleansed and toned and then I've applied a serum and a moisturiser. To start the makeup I'm applying a hydrating and radiance based primer all over the face. I'm using La Base Pro Hydro Glow. For the base I'm applying Tonto Doll Ultra Wear Foundation all over the face and make sure you blend it down the neck and take a little bit over the ears as well to avoid any redness coming through. This foundation is really buildable so you can make it as light or as full coverage as you like and it has a fresh matte finish. To complete the base, apply concealer under your eyes and pat in with your ring finger to blend and smooth the product. I'm using a translucent loose powder and dusting that over the T-zone to matte down any shine that we don't want and I'm taking a little bit under the eye to set the concealer so that it doesn't crease. To warm and shape the complexion, I'm applying Belle de Tomp bronzer where the sun would naturally kiss your skin. Apply along the cheekbones, the temples and a little bit across the bridge of the nose. And to add a final pop of colour, I'm using Blush Subteal on the apples of the cheeks. To start on the eyes, I'm applying a light beige matte shadow all over, from the lashes up to the brow bone. I'm then taking a glittery taupe shade of shadow and applying that all over the lid up to the socket line and blending for a soft finish. Taking a little bit of that same taupey shadow, just run that under the lower lash line to add extra definition. For the brows, first of all brush them up so you can see what shape you want to create and then fill in any gaps using the Sawseal Daphne pencil. I'm using Hypno's Waterproof Mascara on the upper and lower lashes. This is great for buildable volume and length. And to complete the look, I'm applying a coat of Longcom's Juicy Shaker Lip Gloss to the lips, which adds a subtle pop of colour and is really easy to maintain throughout the day. Oh, oh, oh. 